Let's summarize the content of this unit in a short video. As a teacher, you need to develop a good course concept. First, you need to know the content you want to teach your learners. Once that is known, set reachable learning objectives. Then, chunk the content into digestible topics. Rather make them too short than too long. Each theoretical topic should be followed by a practical task or a hands-on learning activity. Following, the learners either have to receive feedback or be assessed for their learning activity. Both options can be done by their peers. In this case, you have to prepare guiding criteria or questions. Also, you should review this process to make sure that everything was done correctly. And each theoretical input and learning activity with a summary. For the following sessions, we recommend that you always start by reviewing the theoretical input of the previous session. This will help your learners to connect the topics. In all this, make sure that your approach is learner-centered. If anything is unclear, you have to clarify it. Therefore, please don't plan too strict and leave some buffer time. This cycle of review, input, learning activity, feedback or assessment, and summary can be repeated several times. You will find suggestions for different ways of giving input and formats of learning activity in this unit.